hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm doing something a little bit different i'm gonna be putting vaseline on my skin every single day for seven days straight and i know that sounds crazy because if you've been watching my channel for a while you know how much skincare products mean to me i cannot go without serums without spf without my oils and stuff like that but the next seven days it's going to be different i'm going to be using just vaseline so i want to take you guys through day by day to show you how my skin is reacting towards the vaseline and it shouldn't be anything too drastic because i did use vaseline a lot growing up i used to use it on my lips on my face on my body like if you literally have a scratch vaseline and then i just stopped when i reached puberty and i started to get acne that's when i stopped because i felt like it was clogging my pores and doing all of that so now i want to try it once again to see how my skin reacts to it so i'm going to be taking you guys through day by day to show you what my skin is doing as you guys may or may not may or may not know i have an oily t-zone and a dry outer layer and because it's winter now my skin is getting a little bit more drier as the days go on so i just kind of want to see what it does to like my outer layer in terms of that dryness i want to see if it'll fix it but some fun facts about vaseline vaseline is not a moisturizer it works as a occlusive i'm not saying that word right and i yeah it's i'm gonna put the word on the screen occlusive i think so what it means is it acts as a sealant so it will seal the moisture in so ideally what you should be doing is using a moisturizer and then putting vaseline on top to get like the maximum hydration effects but that's not what i'm going to be doing i'm just going to be applying vaseline directly onto my skin for some reason let's skip to the good part now if you have not subscribed yet please make sure you do subscribe it will mean a lot to me without further ado let's jump right into this video hey guys so i've literally just washed my face um so instead of doing my nighttime routine i'm gonna be putting a vaseline on this is the vaseline that i've got it's the petroleum jelly one um yeah so this is like the original one so i'm just gonna go ahead and do that like my skin looks so dry right now my lips look so ashy i've not used it yet because this is a new pot i'm not gonna put that much because i feel like i don't i'm probably not gonna need that much so let's see wow Okay guys, so this is how my skin looks with the Vaseline on. I feel like I put too much Vaseline on because my skin looks very, very oily. But then it also feels really, really soft. I think I remember why I stopped putting Vaseline on my face. It feels very, very sticky. So I'm not going to go to bed just yet because I know that this is all going to transfer onto my pillow. So I'm just going to at least wait like an hour or two. I mean, it's still pretty early. It's like 8pm now, so it's still early anyway i cannot sleep at eight i'm gonna zoom you guys in i've got a few like blackheads around here on my nose so it'll be really interesting to see like what happens there i've got no active pimples which is good touch wood touch wood because i've probably jinxed it now but yeah let's see how that works out so i'm just gonna go to bed and then i'm gonna show you guys what this skin looks like in the morning and then i'm gonna just do the same thing i'm gonna put vaseline on during the whole entire day then at night time again just do that for some day. hi guys good morning so i'm gonna take off my head wrap and stuff because I, i'm looking crazy so basically i've just woke up and this is how my skin looks at the moment i wanted to use the natural light instead of the ring light because i wanted to show you guys how my skin looked in its natural form and to be honest with you i'm quite impressed because the vaseline doesn't feel sticky like i thought it would but it's actually not funny enough so i'm gonna come up close so you guys can see I feel like it's too early to actually make like a conclusion i can't be like i absolutely love it um but so far so good so what i'm gonna do now is shower wash my face get ready for the day and just put the vaseline on and show you guys 
how that looks so i've literally just come out the shower and i've got ready and everything and my skin looks a little bit moisturized and i don't know if that's because of the vaseline or that's just because my skin i literally don't know so anyway i've got the vaseline on my fingertips now so i'm just gonna apply it um yeah when i apply it it feels so thick and like really greasy and stuff but yeah it absorbs in like it does absorb in like quite nicely but i don't even know if i could put makeup on top of it but i'm gonna try to do that maybe like tomorrow but today i'm really not trying to wear makeup because i'm just gonna film content um i'm not gonna leave the house because i'm not gonna put sunscreen on so yeah so yeah this is how it looks guys so what i'm gonna do now is i'm just gonna go about my day and just do what i'm trying to do and then i'll check in with you guys at night time just before i go to bed so you guys can see how it is like a few hours after and then obviously the next morning so yeah hey guys so it's now evening oh i shouldn't even be touching my face like this yeah so my face is so oily and i think it's because it was really hot today so my skin feels really really oily so this is very typical for me to be honest like because i have a very oily t-zone but i just look like a grease ball like and when i if i touch my face like i have washed my hands um so if i touch my face like the oil transfers onto my hands so it's like an immense amount of oil but this is expected because it is during the day so i you know don't expect anything less so right now it is seven ish yeah so it's 7 26 right now so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna wash my face and then i'm gonna put the vaseline on my face again just so i can just prepare for bed now so this is where i would do my nighttime skincare routine but of course i'm not doing that so i'm just gonna put the vaseline on that's about it let me stop waffling good morning guys so it is now day three and this is how my skin looks so i've not done anything i've just woke up brushed my teeth sorted out my hair and everything but in terms of my face this is how it looks it's so weird to me because the vaseline it almost like disappears when i wake up it goes really really dry so like my t-zone is like forever oily so that's why you can see like shininess so i had some active spots here and they've kind of closed and i'm not sure if it's because of the vaseline or that's just i don't know because usually i'd put tea tree oil on these spots so i've got like a little spot here um and another one here these just kind of appeared so usually i'd put tea tree oil on them to like stop it growing so i kind of want to see what the vaseline is going to do to them this side there's literally nothing um, but the good thing is, um, remember those black heads that I was talking about? If I come in closer, let me zoom you guys in. I can't really see them. If I'm honest, like compared to the first footage, it was so much worse. So this is so much better, which I really liked. So I've washed my face and I've just air dried it. So what I'm going to try and do today is, is to put makeup on to see how it applies with makeup because I do plan on like going out. So I'm going to try putting some makeup on now to see how it looks and how it applies. So as for makeup, it does apply okay. Like I still feel very, very sticky. I'm not going to lie to you. It's disgusting. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go about my day and see how long I've got left until my makeup literally melts off because I see that coming. Um, but so far, like in terms of application, if you're looking for like a glowy slash, um, like a subtle makeup look i think vaseline works pretty well um so yeah i will clock in with you guys at the end of the day to show you how i look hi guys so my makeup is looking ridiculous like i said it would i'm looking really greasy i have blotted i've used like tissue to blot my face like five times today 
I never blot so I really don't recommend using Vaseline as a primer for makeup it's just not ideal basically the end of the day now and it's basically time for me to get ready for bed so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wash my face and put the Vaseline on and go to bed and then wake up which my day four hi guys so i've literally showered did my hair and washed my face this is what my skin looks like on day four with nothing on it um it's feeling really dry at the moment especially like around my mouth area but i will say that my skin feels so 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 soft uh, and the pimple that was here from last time as you can see it's like a lot smaller and i think it's even like going down and i'm like without tea tree i'm gonna put resting on the same amount as last time It just feels really soft around my nose area like before it felt really hard um in comparison to now like it feels really soft so i'm just gonna go about my day now and check in with you guys if i don't get to film at night i will definitely film tomorrow which is my day five hi guys good morning welcome back <laughs> Why do I keep I keep trying to do an intro? So this is how my skin looks with the Vaseline today and so far so good. I do have a little bit of an issue now and I don't know if it's because of the Vaseline or it's just my skin but if you look close here you can see that I've got a little pimples kind of like they almost look like white heads i've got it a little bit along here as well and i'm not sure what's caused that but what i think it is is my skin is just like adjusting because usually to control things like this i would use niacinamide because it's good for white heads and black heads um but because i'm not using none of that i'm just relying on the vaseline it's probably like what is going on right now so i'm just going to keep using the vaseline of course right now i have washed my face and i've got the vaseline on i put an extra layer on today because my skin felt a little bit dry but in terms of appearance wise it looks good like to me it looks really really good and like i said yesterday i am so surprised at how my skin is reacting like is handling it really well it could have been so much worse so this is good um so what i'm gonna do now is just go about my day it's like early morning basically <laughs> it's like when i say early morning it's like 11 a.m it's not early but um i'm just gonna go about my day now and check in with you guys hi guys so basically this is how my skin is looking today so i have showered and i did my eyebrows and everything but i didn't moisturize my skin so i've just done that now and my skin does feel really really soft like the white heads i had here have literally completely gone and the one that was on my nose are so much softer like it's this you crazy because i'm telling you when i have white heads i have to literally use a chemical peel to get them off because physical exfoliation for me is like a big no so this is crazy um so i'm really impressed with those results um i'm just gonna continue doing what i'm doing today and yeah check in with you guys for the next day but so far so good good morning guys good morning good morning i feel like i woke up on the right side of the bed today <laughs> so this is how my skin looks personally i am very impressed so i'm loving this whole journey with the vaseline i didn't expect it to be this good i genuinely was expecting maybe the worst because i just use so much skincare for it so far i'm loving it i've literally just opened my windows to let some sunlight in so i'm just gonna wash my face reapply the vaseline but yes i'm gonna give you guys a close-up of my skin like i always do um this is a side profile as you can see my pimples are literally gone how it got rid of my pimples i don't know um yeah 
Hi guys, I literally forgot to do an outro for the video. I didn't even summarize it, but I'm gonna do it now. So what I wanna say about Vaseline is, I only have good things to say. Like this is the bomb. Like this is why my skin was so soft when I was younger. It's to do with Vaseline. I don't know why I stopped using it. I literally have no idea. So what I'm gonna do now is, I'm gonna start moisturizing my skin with my moisturizer and then sealing it with Vaseline. I had like a lot of dry, patchiness around my outer layer that is gone um gone is very much an exaggeration but it's definitely a lot better like a lot of moisturizers don't even get my skin hydrated like around this area so when i tell you that vaseline alone did that that is some really really good progress so what i'm really excited to start doing is using it with moisturizer because i know that's actually gonna hydrate my skin and then this is gonna seal in the moisture i wish i could get you guys to feel my skin because it feels so soft and i feel like it looks really healthy as well and i just I'm just a loss for words. <laughs> um, so yeah, I definitely recommend using some Vaseline, guys. It's affordable. It's not something that's like on the pricey side. And it's just available literally everywhere. Definitely, definitely recommend. Get yourself some Vaseline, guys. And thank me later. <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe. I will definitely catch you on my next video. And if you want me to try out any other products, I kind of want to make this a series uh trying out different products for a week just to show you guys how much skin reacts and stuff like that so just let me know what you want me to try out i am your canvas um so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i will catch you on my next video bye